Welcome to Virtualize Everything. Today we're going to be taking a look at how to create a spot to upload your ISOs to inside of XCP-NG. And then we'll take a look at how to upload an ISO from your host computer or your personal computer to the server. The first thing we're going to do after loading Zen Orchestra to add our new storage location is going to be to go to New and then Storage. Here at Storage, we'll tell it which host we want to use, and we're just going to use the one host that's been set up on Zen Orchestra. Then we need to give it a name, and we'll call ours ISO today. We also need to give it a description, and then we need to select a type. We're going to select Local, and we're going to select Local under ISO SR. Now we need to give it a path, so let's give it a path simply of slash media, and we can hit Create. Now we have a place to upload our ISOs to. In order to upload an ISO to our storage location, we're going to go to Import, and we're going to choose Disk. Then we're going to select the location we want to upload. And I've already added an SMB one here from a previous demonstration, but I'm going to scroll down to use the one on our local system that's called ISO that we just created right here. And now we want to take our ISO that's on our desktop or wherever we downloaded it from and drag it up to this window. Now it'll show us the ISO that we want to import right here. We can go ahead and hit import and that process will start happening. If we want to watch the status of our process and see when our ISO has been fully uploaded, we can go ahead and go to tasks and here we'll see the task that's be happening right now, which is the uploading of our ISO. If you enjoyed today's video, found it informational and helpful for learning XCP-NG, or you would like other virtualization content about Proxmox, LXC, Docker, or other virtualization technologies, please consider liking, sharing, and subscribing to help virtualize everything continue to grow. As always, have a good night.